हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल आई एम बैक विथ थ्री अमेजिंग एक्सेल ट्रिक्स दैट विल मेक यू एडवांस इन एक्सेल सो आर फर्स्ट ट्रिक इज हाउ टू बिल्ड इंटरेक्टिव एंड डायनेमिक डैशबोर्ड इन एक्सेल इफ आई शो यू दिस दैट हाउ इट इज यूज लेट सी इफ आई सिलेक्टेड फाइव स्टेट्स it will show me data with graphs and pie diagrams so let's see how we can build interactive and dynamic dashboard we have one data that is with state name and population in 2011 and estimated population in 2023 first you have to select this data then click on control t and make it table now insert the slicer we are in table design go to insert slicer select state name then click on okay it will create slicer for you that i have shown here this is my slicer now again now we have to insert here graphs for this you have to select this table and then you can also use recommended graphs that it is showing that i have taken you can put it here now i am taking new chart that is bar graph again i am taking pie graph donut this one make it big you can change the format like this now i am going to insert tab then click on bar chart you can use new chart that is 2d graph paste it here now i am again going on to insert and insert this one this is how you can build interactive dashboard now with the help of slicer you can choose which states you want to show here as i have selected four states that is andhra pradesh arunachal pradesh bihar and chandigarh it is showing me data for four states you can also choose five and make it big also you can change format for this this is how you can build interactive and dynamic dashboard let's move to our next trick that is how to convert excel to pdf so this is our data first you have to go to file tab then go to export then click on create pdf and you can save it where you want to save it will create pdf for you now let's move to our next trick that is how to create check box in excel as you see this these all are check box let's see how we can insert these check box first i am putting here border
again i have created completed tab now you have to go to developer tab go to insert then click on checkbox and create here you can make it small if you want and just click on this and delete this written text select this press control plus T now you can check if your task is completed so thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon and if you have any doubt regarding excel please do comment and please share this video so that your friend can also learn advanced excel